I can't believe I've got my hands on it. It's finally here, the Riga System 1. Hello. So we've been eagerly awaiting its arrival for well over a year, but this is it. We finally have the Riga System 1 in front of us, and I can't wait to rip the box open. Now, if you have a sharp memory from some of our previous turntable videos, you might have heard us mention the word, well, phrase, Riga System 1. And this is Riga's take on an all-in-one analog hi-fi setup with minimum hassle that comes in all one box for a sensible price. Now due to various reasons including supply chain issues it has had well over a year's delay but it is launching this week in December 2021. So in the box we've got a Riga Planner 1 turntable, the Riga IO amplifier and two Riga Kite loudspeakers. It's quite hard to believe that it all fits in the same box really. But it's available to order now for 1199. So first impressions of the packaging. I love that it's all cardboard, all fully recycled. There's no plastic here. If we turn it around, you can see Riga System 1. Love this little vinyl for the, for the one. Uh, everything is made in England. And if we turn it around again, you even got a nice little QR code for your setup. Really nice. So I've been dying to unbox it. Let's open it. So here they are then in their full glory. Now I must admit, I'm quite familiar with unpackaging all of these components, but in one box, it's so much more satisfying. It feels like Christmas has come early. So here we have their best-selling turntable, the Riga Planner One, their newest compact amplifier, the IO, and of course their kite speakers, which is a new take on their older bookshelf speakers. Now they were even kind enough to throw in two lots of three meter Riga specification thick speaker cable. So literally everything you need to start enjoying your records is included in the box. So the idea behind the Riga System 1 is that it takes British manufacturer Riga's 48 years worth of experience in crafting excellent quality turntables, followed by amps and then speakers, and puts it all into a one box solution for the hi-fi beginner or downsizer. Now Riga's headquarters are in Essex UK where the majority of components are handmade and all parts are assembled. Now we've actually done a tour of the HQ in a previous video where we also met the legendary Roy Gandhi himself. So check that out if you're interested in having a snoop around. So as I've mentioned, this package aims to break down the barriers and the confusion when shopping for hi-fi components and just gives the buyer that reassurance that the turntable, the amp, the speakers, they're all gonna work together in perfect harmony. Maybe you wanna take the first step into your audiophile journey, but you may be feeling just a little bit overwhelmed by all the choice and the reviews that are currently on the internet. So this is the perfect hi-fi starter package, which can also be upgraded over time, of course. And just to underline their confidence that they have in their products, you get a lifetime warranty, lifetime, directly with Riga. So in the rare instance that any of these components develops a fault, you can be safe in the knowledge that the Riga team have got your back. Now, one of the huge benefits of buying the Riga System 1 is that it takes all of the hassle away for you. And another great thing Riga have done is add that QR code on the box. And all you need to do is scan the QR code on your phone like this, and you'll be shown a video on how to get everything set up. Super straightforward and a brilliant addition that just takes hassle-free setup even further. I've also just noticed that you also get the uh, QR code on the front of the instruction manual. Or if you're old fashioned, you can obviously peruse the instruction manual like a booklet. So we're gonna to have to go into a bit more detail about each of these components. I'm really sorry to break up the family, but we need to showcase each of these components in its full glory. So here you've got the Riga Planner One turntable, which although is their entry level turntable, would you believe, it's also their best selling for its performance per pound. And not to mention, it has won what Hi-Fi's best turntable between 200 pounds and 500 pounds for not one, but six years running. Now it is a fully manual belt driven turntable which takes on a matte black finish. As you can see, it takes on a minimalistic understated design and contrary to other turntables that we've seen on the market, which comes with all sorts of switches, dials, bells and whistles, this is crafted with simplicity and elegance in mind. 
Now it is one of the easiest turntables to set up as you simply unbox the packaging, like removing the cartridge cover, the cardboard from underneath the platter, then screw on the counterweight onto the end of the arm as far as it will go, assemble the belt onto the pulley, which will also dictate the speed, plug it into mains power, make your connections to the amp, and that's really all there is to it. Now that does sound like a lot, but I promise you, you'll get this set up in five minutes, 10 at the very maximum. And yes, it does come with a hinged dust cover, and that's just gonna protect your turntable from gathering dust. Oh, it feels like deal or no deal when you're opening the box. Got one P. <laughs> Next, you've got this mini amplifier, the Riga IO, which is actually their most recent compact amplifier edition. It's already won two Watt Hi-Fi awards in 2020 and 2021 for being the highest rated stereo amplifier under 400 pounds. And this is obviously the component that's gonna drive the kite speakers with 30 watts per channel into eight ohms. Now, downsizing the hugely popular Brio amplifier, but still managing to retain that sonic signature was always gonna be quite the challenge for Riga's designers. But they've actually managed to do this extremely well. What they've done is carefully downsized key areas that don't directly impact performance, such as the number of line-ins to three, and reducing the case size to reduce the build process. And these downsizing processes do not directly impact performance, but keep the Riga IO at an affordable cost to the end user. Now, as I've discovered, it is actually quite a weighty unit at almost four kilograms, but it does remain at a compact footprint to keep things looking visually neat and tidy and not taking up too much space. Again, it's not an overly complicated design. So you've got this uh, volume dial on the front and the headphone output for um, powering standard headphones. And then if we turn it around, you've got some good quality metal speaker cable binding posts and then three analog line ins. One is obviously the phono input, which you're gonna plug the turntable into. And that utilizes a moving magnet phono stage, which essentially means you can plug the turntable straight into the phono input and there's no additional components to worry about. The other two line-ins are for connecting any other hi-fi components you have, like a CD player, a tape deck, or a Sonos port, or a Blue Sound node, perhaps. But in all seriousness, having a wireless streamer does give you the best of both worlds of streaming and vinyl. Just don't tell the guys at Riga I said that. There are people out there who just wanna stream after a busy day at work and then get the vinyl spinning only at the weekends. And the beauty of this setup would be that you can use the supplied remote control to switch between the inputs, adjust volume, etc., things like that. Oh, and we have done a full review of the Riga IO on its own, which might be useful if you're considering using elements of the Riga system, but maybe wanna mix and match a bit more. So moving on to the final component in the Riga System 1 then, which are of course the loudspeakers themselves, the Riga Kites. Now this isn't the first time the kite name has actually been used in Riga, but the original kites they took on a much different appearance to these. These new kites have been dr improved drastically both in terms of aesthetics and performance. And the way that Riga have manufactured the kites, I should tell you about because it is quite interesting, it's created in a large injection mold tool. The material is carefully selected and they settled on a specific thermoset phenolic resin. Blimey, that was a handful. And that just makes it extremely rigid. Now the kites are also internally braced both vertically and horizontally to make the cabinet really stiff and it reduces unwanted noise and improves both how dynamic the speakers are and the bass performance. Now I think these look really modern and fit the minimalistic styling of the rest of the Riga System 1 system. Now you do even get an optional foot for each speaker to isolate the speaker from the surface and places the front into a better vertical plane. Now I would recommend using this for the best performance. So how would we describe the sound quality? Well sadly I can't demo this for you guys due to copyright reasons, but I can give you a bit of an insight on what to expect. So in our testing, I found that it offers a really well-balanced, transparent sound performance. You can hear all the intricacies of the track, like the breaths that the artist takes, the sound of the fingers on a guitar, and this will all help to bring you closer to the music. And that's ultimately what we want from a system, right? Bass doesn't take the center stage either, so that's something that you'll either like or you'll dislike, and it means that some genres sound better than others. So for example, classical, jazz, acoustic, and blues, they all sound exceptional, but more modern bassy or electronic tracks with heavier bass lines, I think, are a little bit underrepresented on the Riga System 1, and they would benefit from a separate subwoofer. 
Now, there's no dedicated sub out on the IO, but many subs can be connected via speaker terminals, so this could be an option for you if you've got a compatible sub. Oh, and I almost forgot the vocals. The vocals, they are so sharp and clear. If you listen to a lot of vocal-based music, you're going to really love these. Now, I'm so glad that Riga have put the effort in here because for me, speakers that don't have good vocals are speakers not really worth having. There is a real synergy here between these components and that's why the Riga System 1 is so unique. For the seasoned audiophile, the Riga System 1 is probably not going to be on their shortlist. They will already have a thorough understanding of which brands and audio components work together. But there's plenty of people out there who don't and that's totally okay. And I think the hi-fi industry can be a daunting place, especially if you're new to it. So by creating the Riga System 1, they are welcoming hi-fi beginners with open arms and encouraging music lovers to bring themselves closer to their artists with vinyl. There's just something about vinyl that streaming can't recreate. And for those that already have vinyl, you'll know what I'm talking about. But for those who haven't stepped into that realm yet, you will find it's quite addictive, I promise you. So yes, I know I could talk all day about how vinyl is so great, but how do you know if the Riga System 1 is going to be right for you? Well, I think I've hinted at it already. For the hi-fi beginner, this is gonna be so perfect for you. Is it wrong that I'm actually excited about the idea of someone just venturing into vinyl and buying this setup, knowing just how well these components work together? Or you may already have a record collection and you're just getting back into it and you could either be upsizing or downsizing. Another consideration to make would be how large your room is because I think these are best expressed in a small or medium sized room or maybe even in an apartment where you need to consider your neighbors and you don't want thumping bass reverberating around your whole block. If you have a larger room, say more than 25 square meters, you may want to look higher up in the Riga range or a different system completely. So just to remind you, it's 1199 to buy the full system, but you can buy each of the components separately if you've maybe got other ideas about what setup you want to use. Now the Riga System 1 is available to order globally at launch, so I'll pop links for everything in the description below. Pop your comments down below as well if you have any questions. So that's all from me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you very soon.